Good morning, everyone, and welcome back. We are on day four here on Lapis Lakeside. Uh, one thing I wanted to correct real fast yesterday, I said in grade two is where Dedenne starts to spawn on Lapis. I was slightly incorrect. It's actually grade one. So if Dedenne were out, we would have been able to have an opportunity to find Dedenne yesterday during our sleep research. So wanted to correct that before we got a little further. I was slightly off on that. And I want you guys to make sure that you have the correct information moving forward so that you can make the right decision for yourself. We are having some issues with the game screen looking kind of ugly. Um, give me one sec. Let me be right back. I'm going to see if I can fix that. Okay, we're back. I think it should be looking pretty good moving forward. We should be all right. We are going to get 12,744 sneaky snacking. I am still seeing a little bit of ugliness there, but it's a lot better than it was before. So maybe I need to mess around with this um, uh, after the recording. So if it does mess up, I apologize. Sorry if it's looking kind of rough today. We did get a dream cluster small for wrapping up or finishing up our stamp collection for going to bed on time and 100 sleep points for going for sleeping as long as we should. 2,309 is our current grand total. And then the daily lottery, we get 20 diamonds. Very nice, okay. Today's gonna be a good day, maybe. Let's see. Let's see how this goes. Let's jump into this sleep report. And with any luck, we'll somehow get to Dene early. Maybe we'll get a glitch, who knows? This game's full of them, so maybe. Session 222, let's see. Actually, no, I have noticed that the game hasn't crashed on us in a while either. Eight hours and 45 minutes of sleep. With 13% dozing, 47% snoozing, and 40% slumbering. And that should be a balanced type, yeah. So we did get a balanced sleep, so we should have some interesting stuff pop up today. A new stuffle would be nice. A new Ralts, maybe. You know, maybe 15 million. Yeah, we did hit 15. Oh, we actually hit quite a lot more than I thought. 19.1 million drowsy power with six spawns on the board. Hmm. We might see something pretty interesting today. Let's see what we get. All right. So, nothing new so far. And, but it does look like no new sleep styles today. We got a pseudo wudo, a Jigglypuff, an Ekans, a Mankey, a Pichu. Mm, that could be interesting. And a why not? Uh, the Mankey and the Pichu might be the most interesting things here. Let's see if anybody's hungry. Having a better Raichu candidate might be a good thing. The Raichu we have is the starter one I got. So, and it hasn't been too bad, but a better one would also possibly be a good thing. Um, hmm, no one's hungry, which is also a problem. So I'm thinking, thinking we feed the Pichu the bonus biscuit and we see nothing happened. And then I think we just leave it there. I don't really want to spend any more biscuits than we've already spent this week, unless we find something really crazy. Um, really would like to hold on to as many as I can for the electric week. And then we're going to send out some, you know what? We're on Lapis. Let's send out some Makey Candy to help other people get to Lapis and have a good time while they're there. Hopefully a better time than we've been having so far this week. It hasn't gone terribly, but it has not gone well. We did get 1,023 research XP and 1,785 dream shards. So not bad at all for a Thursday. And then moving on, we did not catch anything. So nothing to calculate, but I do see, yes, we have some new news. All right. So we have the good sleep day bundles announced and good sleep day number eight as well. So let's go ahead and check out the bundle. Let's see what that's going to look like. Um, the event begins on March 24th. The bundle 
uh, will be available March 22nd from 11 p.m. to March 27th at 11 p.m. And it's going to be 1,500 diamonds. Okay, that's big. That's big diamonds with two growth incense, two luck incense, and two focus incense with nine great biscuits. So it's looking pretty similar to most of the bundle, the sleep day bundles. Um, I think the price is about the same from what I remember. And most of them typically have a bunch of incense and great biscuits. So yeah, it's pretty similar. I mean, I feel about the same about this one as always. It, it's all right. If you've got the extra diamonds, it's worth it. But if you don't have the diamonds or if you're a free player, your diamonds are better spent uh, on your inventory increases. So maybe don't splurge on that unless you're willing to pay for some diamonds. Um, this just explains what the incense do. Yeah, it's typical stuff. Nothing too fancy. Nothing out of the ordinary. So we can go ahead and move on to the actual sleep day. Um, during this time, blah, blah, blah. Let's go ahead and move on to uh, just the breakdown. So day one is March 24th. And then day two is March 25th. And day three is March 26th. And since day two falls on a Monday, we do get to times four. Uh, so the night of the full moon, March 25th, drowsy power times four, which is going to be pretty good for a Monday. If you want to be real cheeky, go somewhere that you've got a high uh, island bonus, one of the first islands, maybe even Cyan, and you can get a really high drowsy score for that sleep research. Um, or you can use it to get a jump start. Let's see, March 25th, that might... Wait a minute, wait a minute, hold on. Let me double check something. Let's see, we're gonna we're gonna live fact check. Uh, not the electric week, Ryko. When was Ryko coming? Beginning at the end of March? Did they tell us exactly? No, but that is the last week of March. Um, I don't think. Yeah, that is the last week of March. So that might line up with Ryko, actually. Um, I am not seeing an exact day for when Ryko comes. It just says the end of March. Electric week is next week. So that does put a week in between electric week and good sleep day. So maybe, maybe it'll line up with Ryko. We'll see. If it does, that'll be a really good boost to that week with a times four on Monday. So that'll be really nice. But anyway, back to breaking this down real quick. The good sleep day, Monday, March 25th, drowsy power times four, Pokemon sleep XP times three, and bonus sleep points times a thousand, or plus a thousand, not times a thousand. That would be way, way different. Plus a thousand bonus sleep points. And then on the other days, March 24th and 26th, we get drowsy power one times 1 1.5, Pokemon sleep XP times two, and 500 bonus sleep points. So again, if you're going to use your incense, make sure to save them for the main day on March 25th if you only have one set of incense. But any of the days are really good to use some of the incense. But if you only have one, just use it on the main day that Monday. Uh, other than that, everything else looks pretty standard. And this is just a reminder of the new breakdown for good sleep days. And then just the standard notes about how to actually uh, take advantage of good sleep day. Other than that, nothing new, but I'm curious if this is going to line up with Ryko. If it does, then there's going to be some strategy involved, but let's go ahead and move on. Hopefully they'll announce when Ryko is pretty soon and we can figure that out. No medals, but we do have some community reports. About 43 of them, I bet. 45, there we go. With 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 11 that doubled up right around that 25 percent for almost exactly 25 percent with a level up that's good for an ingredient ticket small there we go all right speaking of ingredient tickets let's go ahead and collect our ingredients and whatnot from our pokemon uh gengar come on i need you to step up today buddy you did all right for the first half of yesterday but then you started slacking you have been doing really well continuing to do pretty well 12 oil, that's more than what we need. That's a 
a dish and a half. I don't know why I clicked on you. You are not going to do anything for me today. You are just collecting nothing but berries. And you, there we go. That's what we need, that ingredient magnet. So one out of three. It did give me some interesting stuff. All right, let's jump into breakfast. And we can make... We can make the slowpoke tail pepper salad, but I think I'm going to hold off and save those ingredients for the actual electric week because we need to try to maximize as much as possible that week uh, just to have enough drowsy power for Dedenne to show up. And also with doing the slowpoke tail pepper salad and the spore mushroom salad yesterday there was only about a 2000 point difference in their final totals um which there's about a 2000 point difference 2600 point difference between them now so take that for what you will but to me that says it's not really worth doing the slowpoke recipe unless we're just trying to absolutely min max the score coming out of there uh we can can we use the honey or what was i saving that for um we do, 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 yeah we should be able to use the honey yeah we can use that honey that's fine oh i guess i scrolled by accident all right well, let's go ahead and get that going that and also, back to the slowpoke recipes, they're not really the strongest in the game anymore now that we've had these new recipes added, but that is 11,988 from the spore mushroom salad. And that will, will that put us at another at the next level? It might. Let's find out. And we get to ultra eventually this week. <laughs> I know the team analysis projection was ultra two, but I would like to beat that. It does put us to great four. And we do still have the rest of today and then three full days, including Sunday, to hopefully get above ultra two. That would be nice to break our record. But I don't know. Salads have kind of kind of haunted us this week, to be honest. Uh, salads are not not necessarily the easiest thing to to do on lapis but so far everything's looking good got good sleep day dates we know when that's coming up good sleep day bundles are coming out as well and we've got still electric week next week i believe and then Ryko coming up later this month so we've got a lot to look forward to i'm really excited about that and that is all I've got for today. So thank you for watching the video. Make sure to hit that like button if you liked it. Subscribe if you want to see more. And until next time, later dudes.